been aligned with an effort to agitate for a proper representation of Marcus Mother Garvey. Based on who he is and what he represents as a people and the empowerment and inspiration that he has given to our people all over the world from Little Island of Jamaica from in the late 80s, 1880s until now. And so the University of West Indies, which should be working in harmony with the aspirations, the legitimate aspirations of the people in education, in social and cultural, political and religious areas if possible, because they have a theological institute as well. And so we are saying, if this man represents so much to us as a people who have got through so much struggle and who have been through so great tribulation and still going through such great tribulation, why dispossess the man of the attributes which epitomize what he represents and which can give the people what he prescribed for them, what he spent his whole life trying to provide for them. How would you, you describe the, what is there now on the, on the campus? It's a misrepresentation. So you're, you're not just presenting something, you're representing it. So you could distort it and you could honor its original form. Our thinking is that it has distorted the original form, so it's, it misrepresent. Misre you with me? So it's an un unacceptable. And if you are part of a democratic country, practicing democratic tradition, we are to arrive at national decisions based on consultation. Build consensus to community consultation. Make the grassroots people feel like me a smarty pick the two. You find them your opinion, Virgin. And how me think me maybe not the big pretty world like you. Yeah. And oh no. Still know what I but we still know we are going through intuition. Because we are not dead people, we are living people, we are brave too. And we are seeing on every day. And we don't have the proper word in our jargon to describe what happened. But we are taught it in a limited, uneducated way. So that now represents where we are dealing with another that we know another that we want. You want, you know, respect that. And you say you have the practice democracy. Democratic. Warm to the consultation. Why you don't want to raise with I and I? We're not good enough? Because you represent the, the neo colonial constructions which want to perpetuate colonialism and slavery. Or you don't want to build consensus up from ground up and then you walk up and down and, 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 and squeal over crime and violence. Mm, as smile. if crime is not violence and violence yeah. is not crime. So you don't even understand what you're dealing with up to this day. Yes. 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 So, 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 and disrespect the woman who was here on the earth before the man. That if the, the males of the society I call a, a man a street key yeah. and go home and go beg him wife to give him some peace. Yeah, yeah. So, so he go home and go beg him wife for the man who him called Pia Road and insult your own dignity and your own origin. We don't see nobody about from no ribs and up to this day. And then now when you feel come talk to represent the culture and with people, you don't want to talk to we and we're not good enough and we're not valuable enough and we opinion not count enough. And you say you yeah, practice democracy. Oh. It's democratic dictatorship. Huh. Straight. Same way. And false pretexts. Just for do what you want to do. And we have to take that. Take it and leave it.